that dancer got any talent, it must be in her grandmother's name. You know, Joey, it's a... Hey, c come to think of it, what are you doing around here? And what's this bit of sneaking around backstage? I'd like to talk to you. Oh, come on, Joey, all right, I'm here, talk to me. I'd like to talk private to you. Now, you know I can't talk private, we got a show going on. I gotta hang around here. Can we go in your office? I don't know. You... Oh, you look like this is a serious thing with you. It is. I'm your friend. Okay, come on, let's go. You know, my office is way across the alley over there. Gee, why you pick a time like this? To... I don't know. Right over here. I don't understand why if you got something to ask me, you can't ask me when we got a plenty of time instead of... Joey? Hey. Hi, Walter. Hi. I have been. I'm a, all nice, right. Nice, I, nice seeing you. Oh. Okay. Hey, hey, Joey. Listen, you want to get a laugh? Oh, guess who popped up? Your friend, that comic, uh, Walter Sage. Yeah, he popped right up out of the lake. What do you think of that? Uh, despite the numerous punctures in the body and the heavy slot machine used as a weight, the body did not lose its buoyancy and rose to the surface. See, with a bum like that, you gotta be a doctor or else he floats. You swore you were only gonna rough him up. Oh, well, that's all we did, but uh, you see, the man was in delicate health. He couldn't take it. He couldn't take a nice pick in the gutter. Shut up. Why? Why did you kill him? He had bad breath. Now, you listen to me. This is it. From this, you take no walks. Stay in line, keep your mouth shut. He get killed. And the wife, too. Huh? Edie. That's right. Edie. Huh? That's the whole story. Listen, uh, where is Edie? You know, I haven't seen her seven, eight years. Much be longer. Nice girl. A little tall. Hey, come you on, know, at one go. time I had to... Take it easy. Wait, what's the rush? just want to talk to her, say hello. Will you come on? Hey. Hey, you remember me? Abe Relish. You remember? Kid, where's the fellow with the chocolate twist candies? What is he doing here? Nothing. Nothing. I just come up to say congratulations, that's all. You know, Joey's a friend of mine, and I'd like to congratulate you. Right. Come on, Relish, let's go, huh? Come on. Nice talking to you. Nice girl. She hasn't changed much. She's still... Joey! Talking. What kind of business are you mixed up in? Oh, no kind of business, honey. No Please kind tell of me. I want to know. Wait a minute. What's all the excitement here? I just came up to pay a friendly visit. Get out of here! Take it easy, Edie. Just take it easy. Listen, what's your problem? What do you have to do with Joey? What are you worried so much about Joey for? He's a big man. He's a citizen. And you're a scum! Now, wait a minute. You know, you got a big mouth. Come on, will you really? No, Come no, on. no. You know, she's got a big mouth. I told you to get out. What are you, some kind of nut? Who are you? What are you? What do you think? You're a princess? Can't talk English. You're telling me to get out. Now, this is Bronzeville. You know what? It stinks, but I own it. And around here, nobody tells me what to do. Now, you get smart. Go back in the bedroom and do something with yourself. Fix your hair. Relish. That's my wife you're talking to. Yeah, so what? So what? So this ain't Bronzeville. This is my house, and that's my wife, and don't you forget it, you hear? No, I won't forget it. Let's go. Now. Yeah. You know what? I ain't even mad. 
I'm going to tell you something about women. I never met one that didn't need a rap in her head. I'm pretty open. of ice cream. You want an egg? Uh, why not? Uh, Mrs. Carsey, I was up the block a little while ago checking with your neighbors. Lace it with rat poison. <laughs> Ellis, has he been here? This looked like a hotel. You think I keep a register? Just ask you. Oh, stop asking. Every cop with a big nose end up in Staten Island shooting Indians, ain't it so? <laughs> it could happen. Uh, it could happen. Sure, it can happen. So mind your business and don't ask questions. I got a job to do. A job. Sure. You got to do a job. Here's a pencil. Go right to gets. Ask the others who got stores. Ask Albrazio, the shoemaker. Ask Albrazio what happened to him when the cops came. They said, don't pay protection, Albrazio. We protect you. So Albrazio, the dumb idiot, he doesn't pay. Two days later, he's in the hospital, every bone in his body broken. And leave the Taylor. First to come the cops, next to come the mob. They pour acid on every suit he's got hanging in his shop. They smash his machine right in open the daylight. And where are the cops? You tell me. Where are the cops? Oh, what are you giving me, Mrs. Corsi? We came. Nobody to talk. Oh, sure. With a teeth kicked in your mouth, who want to talk? No, leave us alone. We don't want no cops. Good. I had it with an egg. Well, yeah. Hey, that's good. That's nourishing, that one. Hello, Joey. You playing in the kids' band? I don't play in anybody's band. Oh, that's right. You're a singer. That's a good thing to remember. I've been looking for you, Ellis. I'm taking you in. Hey, uh, you got a warrant? Oh, yeah. Never without one. Huh? Ain't he getting out again, Finn? 